spicy margarita. But instead, yeah. <laughs> we are going to visit Nobu, Chicago. Well, they have some good drinks as well. Recently launched its Tanoshe Hour, serving up discounted bar bites and drinks, including Wagyu burgers or sliders, mm. market margaritas, and much more. Executive chef Edgar Escalante Vasquez joins us now with more. Chef, welcome. Thank you so much for having me. I know me. we're going to be making ceviche in a little yes. bit, but uh, tell us about you. You're new to Chicago. Yeah, I mean, I moved from D.C. Like, I'm very excited to be here. It's yeah. very nice. Only a few months ago. Yes. Oh, Stick around yeah. for the summer. You're going to fall in I love. Can't wait. Yes. can't wait. Well, we're hoping that everyone falls in love with your new Tanoshe. Tanoshi. Uh, Tanoshi. Yeah, that, yeah, that's the other thing, because it's a, a hard end. Tanoshi. Yeah, Tanoshi. Tanoshi. <laughs> yes. Uh, tell us what that concept is and what it involves. Absolutely. So it's a happy hour. So we're open from um, Monday to Friday from 3 p.m. to 6 p.m. Mm -hmm. So we offer a uh, classic from Nobu, like gelote jalapeno, salmon dry miso, but oh. we also like try to spice it up a little bit. So we make a spicy miso chicken karage, which is gluten-free. We have our gyozas, our classic as well, and sliders, and we're going to be making a... Vegetable ceviche. That's okay. what I love about Noble. You can go and you can order five or six or seven different yeah. things and not feel guilty because you get a little taste of Absolutely. everything. That's what's so special about Noble, Absolutely, right? Absolutely, yes. And this is a different take on ceviche because ceviche is usually made with like a seafood, right? Yeah. Mm. So we're trying to get a different approach, you know, like vegan people is out there. So we were trying to reach them as well. So this sauce is also like vegan and okay. gluten free. So let's get started. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So what do we start with? So we're going to put avocado, mm -hmm. cauliflower. There's a lot of ingredients, but this shouldn't scare you, right? Yeah, because, no, okay, not. The more the better. It looks like tomato. Yes, it's a sweet potato, some Ooh, pickled sweet cucumber. Potato. Oh, and That's some onion. onion. Wow, this love sounds good. And, and, this is, and this? Yeah, yeah, you like this one, Tanya. So I know it looks like tuna, but we compress it in simple syrup so it gets that vibrant color. Okay, so watermelon. And you just need a little bit of each, right? Yes. That's what makes it all Yes, yeah, this so is one special. of my favorite vegetables. It's called rabi. It's a family of the turnips. This is asparagus. Okay. We're gonna put a little bit of salt. You know what's cool too with this kind of pepper. cuisine? It's so pretty. I mean, there's so many different colors and, and that appeal to you know your taste buds and your senses. Absolutely. And what's that? So this sauce is made of uh, a lot of Japanese citrus called yuzu. I don't know if you guys are familiar with it. Mm -hmm. It gets that vibrant citrus. It's very simple, very clear. Mm -hmm. so and how does, that, it how does that mix with all the different ingredients that you're putting so, in? Yeah. So this one is gonna bring up like the acidity that we need. So the fruit and the vegetables is like united. Mm -hmm. oh, now, do we have to let it sit for a little while for the flavors to go through, or is it best fresh? Served no, it's fresh. fresh. Yes. Okay, fresh, fresh served out of there. Okay. And should oh. it be if you're gonna save it, should it be served cold? Yes, cold. always cold. So we're gonna put butter little cups. Okay. And this is what you said, Tanya, about the presentation. How yeah, that always yeah. Makes how it look so important pretty. that is. Oh, oh awesome. Damn. And this is one of the appetizers that you yes, guys are correct. offering. And then we were talking about the rooftop. Rooftop is only open three days a week right now. Yes, yeah, three days a week. Mm -hmm. And uh, we offer also the, the Noble Classics upstairs. Mm -hmm. Noble is such a Chicago favorite. It's yes. such a state. What do, you, what do you attribute all the success to? That everybody knows it, everybody loves it. Yeah, I think Noble is like the godfather of Japanese cuisine. Mm -hmm. So it's like everybody likes it. It's like so much flavors. Mm -hmm. no, we're going to end up with fried quinoa as well, so okay. we get that crunch. And the sp we're looking at the space, absolutely gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Oh, it really and is. And the bar area too as well, so with it being a happy hour, so you must have a very expensive bar. Yes, yes. so we have the bar, like we get like busy every, every day, so it's like very oh, nice. How nice. Okay, well, we'll, we'll All right, now this. I usually won't have a problem eating, but this is just so pretty. I know, it's like how do you eat it? Do you use a fork? Or? No, you use it like a taco. Like, oh, like, like a taco? Oh, you yes. do? So All right, I'm going to use the fork just to yeah, be safe. Yeah, I'm a just messy person, so. Are you enjoy the watermelon? Yeah, yeah, oh, well, yes, I want to okay. try that. Let's I know do you that. do. I'm going to do the sweet potato. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. I do taste the sweetness. Yes. And the, the, yeah. Oh, this is awesome. I love how the dressing or the vinegar, is it yes. a vinaigrette? It's that, a vinaigrette, yes. Yeah. That adds to Lots it? Lots of different yes. flavors. And it's like a lot of layers of flavors. Yes, exactly. All right. Boy, that's, that's wonderful. Actually, thank you so much for coming in. Thanks so much in. for having me, guys. Best of luck. When does, when does the rooftop go? Seven days a week? It's going to be seven days a week, end of May. End of May. All yes. right. Fantastic. Wonderful. Nobu Chicago is on Randolph. There's a phone number, social media handles, as well as the website. Check them out.